Well, we'll start by opening up uh, QSynth and Jack. Jack Control enables us to connect up uh, the fluid synth with the oxygen, which is my MIDI keyboard. And I just check on SQ Synth, and now you're going to see my MIDI keyboard. That's called Oxygen. I uh, produce some sounds like piano or string. Now those are MIDI channels I'm showing you there. Because you broadcast through a MIDI channel onto your computer. Now I'm starting up Ardor. Ardor is starts off with a master track, so now we have to enable the track. So I'll start off to get a track. Add one track. And this will be now we'll connect that up again with Jack. Now you see Jack here. Yeah, on Jack uh, on the control panel you can see Ardor and the various connections and you connect it up with the system playback which is your speakers or headphone. Now QSynth is the MIDI uh, synthesizer on the screen which I'm playing with the MIDI keyboard. Okay, that's connected. So it's worth having a look at Jack to see how you connect different things together. It's all visible unlike say Windows where you don't see these operations but on Linux you see everything. Oh, that's connected. Okay. That's the connecting the synth sounds to the Ardor sound. Right. Now that's uh, that's enables the recording to take place when you when you click on the red button. Alright now so we've got one audio track. That's showing you a mixer. Mixer is enabled when you press click on under window. And there's got click and slide volume controls. Okay. Um yeah, close turn that off. Okay. Now we'll just do a rec enable <coughs> recording. And when you press play, it'll start recording from the keyboard. It's a piano track. Okay, now I've added another track using Jack, and this is going to play the entire three layers of sound. Spin guitar and piano. Let's see the mixer visible again. Very basic. I'll export that to a, an audio file. Give it a name and, of course, a place to put it. Now, and make sure to enable the outputs for all the audio tracks. It's the bottom window in the export window. And you export that. This is called Jammin. This is a plugin you can add onto your uh, Ardor and play the Ardor tracks through it. It's quite a good mixer or a mastering piece of software. It's called JMIN Jammin. It's got a few options on it for looking at the music in, in, in terms of waves and it's got an equalizer as well. I'll show you the windows now. Okay, it's playing it. Equalizer. Spectrum. It's playing quite a low track and then compression goes. This is called hydrogen. It's a drum machine which also you can use to make drum tracks for Ardor. Thank you.